<laughs> What's up guys? It's been a while since we've done a video. Been way, way too long since we've done a video. So we're gonna fix this a little bit, point it down, hopefully you can see me. Woo! Okay. Um, so I got this Boomba bag. And I hope you guys can see it. Right? It's pretty nice. I think these are like $50, $60 maybe, right off the Boomba website. I got it um, at a local Play It Again sports shop. And I'm just gonna do a quick video on how to clean it, right? So you can see we got a lot of dirt, right? We got some fading as well, right? Uh, it's dirty inside there, obviously, and a lot of the creases and everything. And um, how we're just gonna try to clean this up and make this pop a little bit more, right? So what I have is some OxyClean laundry stain remover and a hard bristle brush. Right, you should be able to find this for a couple bucks, find this for like five or six dollars. And then I have my hose here that you guys can see. All right, and we're just gonna simply spray it down and start to work in some of the detergent. So one of two ways, right? Get your brush wet. Sure your brush is clean, obviously. There's one of two ways you guys can do it. You can just spray the whole bag like I am now. Right? Or you can spray the brush. Okay? You know, some of you are probably asking, why are you cleaning this bag so much, Ross? And the simple answer is, I'm either going to use it or I'm going to flip it. And in order to flip it, it cannot be dirty. And the crucial parts, like the logos and what shows the most. Cool. So our next step, obviously, is to take our brush, which I'll put a little bit more juice on the brush here, and just work in. Everywhere you want to clean. There's one or two ways to do this. You guys can spray this whole thing and hand scrub it all and spray it off like I am. Or you could throw it in your um, washer and dryer. Um, I'm probably gonna scrub it all first and then throw it in the washer and dryer. Cool? So we'll scrub. Logos are key, right? Hands are fat. I can't even get my hands in the bottom of a Pringles can. But I'm gonna to try to bring that back to as original as possible. You guys will want to really get inside here in these grooves where all that dirt loves to live. Right? Kind of hard here. Oh, bags are hard to film. So you guys can already see a pretty stark difference here in what we've pulled from the white here and then up here as well. So let's just see if we can get this live. All right, so we can see it's a little brown here. Look at that. Looks great. Hopefully I wasn't out of the shot. Came out really, really, really good. So, we just threw it in the washer. As you guys can see here, got about 40 minutes. It's in there spinning around. So we did both. We did the scrub method, hose it down out here as you guys can see. And then we also made sure to throw it in the washer to get a nice deep clean on it, okay? Um, yeah, that's that. So next segment here, we'll see what it looks like when it's done out of the dryer. And then from there, we'll see what the final product looks like. Cool? All right, cool. All right. Bag looks good. Really nice and clean. Now what we're gonna do here, you see I got some towels. Oops. Got some towels here. We're gonna throw one towel inside to help sop that up. And then we're gonna throw a towel in the dryer as well here. 
just to kind of uh, pad the fall. So I put that there. All right. All right. One. Do normal. So still a little damp inside the pocket here, but the bag overall came out really, really good. You guys can see the Boomba's all real nice and white. We got a little bit of a tear right there. Bottom came out good. Front panel came out good. We'll have to pull some of this off, but um, it's really, really nice embroidery panel. Yeah, not bad, huh? Not bad, eh? We'll get this uh, underneath a white light, really see how good it looks. So as you guys can see, we're down here in the studio. We got our Boomba bag, right? And uh, you can see, I mean, it looks brand new. No dirt anywhere. Brand new, even in the inside. Looking really, really good inside. So we'll reshape that. Right? And then uh, the plan. You can buy, and I have some, I'm not a big fan of this red, pinkish, white color, um, but I think what I'm gonna do actually, and we'll check back in here, we'll do an update on it, is get fabric spray paint that you can actually get, and then a sealer over it, and try to get it to mist it with some black, and try to make sure that some of this still stays and comes through so it'll still kind of look like a smoked out or murdered out digital cam camo that's what i'm gonna go for i think that'll look really good um if that comes out good enough we'll flip and sell if not i'll just keep it for myself use it as a second bag or maybe put some bp balls in there or something okay so that's that yeah it really came out really really nice overall um yeah, I mean this is a this is a nice flip. This is gonna be a really nice flip when it's all said and done. Alright.